Hey, Armin here on why I feel nutrition is critical for longevity. So, nutrition can either be medicine or it can be poison. And this is very true, just look around in society today. If you look at what the food companies have done to people, it's horrific. And people don't know any better, unfortunately. And also there's a lot of bad science that's, you know, said it was accurate, but it's really not. And that's also misleading people. So if you want to live longer, you've got to learn to eat real food and not eat this processed man-made stuff because all it's doing is keeping you uh, in a high level of inflammation because it's sugar-based, carbohydrate-based, and it also has less seed oils. And these, all these things create inflammation. You know, the sugar-based, carbohydrate-based keeps your insulin elevated all the time, which is not good which leads to insulin resistance and a lot of other health problems. And then the seed oils, they're high on omega-6, omega-9 oils. They're not going to help you. And it also raises the inflammation. So you really got to focus on real quality food, organic. Now, when we talk about organic, it doesn't need to be like an avocado it doesn't need to be organic. It's got a hard cover. A coconut does not need to be organic. It's got a hard cover, orange, banana, etc. Those do not need to be organic. Now, Berries, which are soft uh, fruit, things like that, that should be organic the best you can. It's never going to be perfect, but you're moving in the right direction by not eating something that comes in a bag, a box, or has a barcode on it. Because that's going to be man-made, it's going to have preservatives in it, it's going to have these seed oils in it to, to, provide, to help with the freshness. And these are just really bad fats for your system. So you want to buy organic meat, and if it's going to be beef related, you want to make sure it's grass finished. Uh, because that means that the grass ate cows, clover, alfalfa, you know, quality food versus grain, corn, and things like, like that, which aren't helpful. So what they're seeing now is because of people eating a lot of these, you know, processed sugars, food sources, etc., is their ALT level, their alanine transaminase, which is, affects your liver, is becoming elevated and what that leads to is mitochondrial dysfunction which affects your energy which doesn't help you at all and it's also slowly damaging your liver which will lead to non-fatty alcoholic liver disease and that's not good either so if you want to live longer you really want to focus on eating real food make it yourself always question what's being how it's being made and understand the ingredients in it and the more natural you can make it the better because your body can respond to it and give you the nutrients you need to stay vital and you're not going to get as much weight gain either because again you're eating your hormone levels are going to be more in balance because you're not over eating carbohydrates and sugars which create an imbalance so that's why i feel nutrition is critical to longevity let me know your thoughts if you got opinions about it then we can discuss it other than that talk to you again soon have a good one